The time now is 544 and time to get an update on that forecast. Here again is meteorologist Vanessa Alonzo. Vanessa. Thanks a lot, Eric, and good morning to you. It's been a busy morning for me here in the First Alert Forecast Center as we have been tracking showers and thunderstorms since after midnight into this morning. Here's a live look at our Alpha Insurance Sky Cam in downtown Tupelo showing the overcast skies. We've had some flashes of lightning and rain showing on our on our camera over the last 30 to 45 minutes and about a half hour ago we were getting some heavy downpours here in downtown Columbus. Now we're just seeing a steady light rain and those overcast skies currently but it is a warm muggy start to our day with temperatures already in the 70s. Dew points are in the 70s making it very soupy out there so you know we are in for another hot humid summer day on this first day of July. Our current radar is showing the those showers and thunderstorms continuing to push through our eastern Mississippi counties and our western Alabama counties. We have that one storm that pushed through the city of Columbus about 30, 15 minutes ago, and now we have this other round that's pushing through to areas just south of Columbus and pushing into Pickens and southern Lamar County. We have this other storm pushing through Marone County right into northern Lamar and Marion counties, and of course this activity moving from Lee County over into northern Alabama. So again, we are expecting lightning, some heavy downpours, maybe some standing water and possible flooding out on the roadways this morning. So if you do encounter that, on your way out the door to work, find an alternate route. Remember the old saying, turn around, don't drown. And guess what? We're expecting additional chances of showers and thunderstorms, especially this afternoon. And it's going to be a warm one with those temperatures once again topping out in the lower 90s. And we're going to be in this pattern for quite a while as we head into the second half of the work week. Here's our forecast pet for this morning. Lily, she looks like she's ready to get out and about in her cute little dress. But sorry, Lily, your owner will be lucky if she can get you in her dog walk in, not in the rain, as we're going to be watching showers and thunderstorms in the forecast heading into the second half of the week. And it's not just the rain and storm chances. It's going to be hot. It's going to be humid. This is our heat index for today. When you factor in that air temperature in the lower 90s and that humidity, it's going to feel like the upper 90s to lower 100s out there. So make sure you take the proper precautions, especially if you're going to be outdoors for long periods of time. Make sure you take frequent breaks, drink lots of water, stay hydrated, and make sure you have a good place to go with good air conditioning. And again, we do have those chances for some strong storms with gusty winds, heavy downpours, and small hail. So here is the breakdown of that hour by hour forecast really quickly. We're getting a storm system moving in, bringing in those on and off again chances for showers and thunderstorms, and it will continue again heading into the next seven days, but not looking to be, looking to be a washout for 4th of July. Eric. Thanks, Vanessa.